Hey guys, welcome back to another video. The weight is done, as you guys saw in the last video, where I broke down the whole weight cut. If you haven't seen that yet, make sure to check that one out first to see the diet, see how I'm losing all the water. I'm at 61.5 right now. In this video, I'm gonna show you guys how I'm gonna eat it, when I'm gonna eat what, because that's gonna be important as well, and how I'm gonna drink. And then I'm gonna give you guys body updates, so and so many hours after the weigh-in, so and so many hours after the weigh-in, all the way up until when I'm stepping into that cage um, and then I'm going to show you my form then because I'm really, I'm really interested on how much I'm going to weigh this time. I think it's going to be absolutely above 70, maybe even 71 kilograms. So let's see. And now I'm going to start to load up. Right now I'm drinking my electrolyte drink and some coconut water. Let's roll the clip where I'm explaining that. I'm going to prepare my first drink. So what I'm gonna do for this one, first we're gonna have some beautiful water. I'm looking forward to drinking that. And now in this water, we're gonna put this electrolyte powder. So we have our sodium, we have our potassium, our calcium and our magnesium. We just need to take a, a big scoop. And this time we are really gonna take a big scoop because we have, a, we have lost a lot. I think this is gonna be maybe like five grams or so. And just throw it in here. With that, we're gonna put some of these things, uh, these things is just vitamins. It has, gives it uh, all the whole thing some tastes and also it has a little bit of calcium and magnesium. So we're gonna put one of these uh, ones in here and we're gonna put honey because honey is liquid carbs and that's exactly what we need right now, right after the weigh-in because we want the water to be stored in the muscle and for that we need carbs. So we need electrolytes Ooh. and carbs. Yeah, like this. I think I'm gonna put actually a little bit of lemon as well, just to, so it's not too sweet. And we're also gonna put a little bit of creatine in here because creatine will also help us store more of the water in our muscles. The way this drink is right now, you can drink it the whole day. With creatine, don't put too much. I'm gonna put one scoop right now and one scoop in the afternoon. So I will have about 10 grams of creatine today. We don't wanna go too hard on the creatine. Now I'm gonna have my first meal, which is gonna be milk rice. This is, I think, 250 grams of rice and one liter of milk. So, so in terms of nutrients, what do we wanna have right after the weigh-in? We wanna have a lot of carbs, a low amount of fat and a medium amount of protein. So actually, as far as I'm concerned, this is perfect meal because the rice has a lot of carbs that are also very fast carbs, which is what we want right now. So that's why I'm not eating porridge right now because porridge takes a little bit longer uh, because of the fiber that's inside. Rice has almost no fiber, so it uh, goes faster into the body, into the bloodstream, uh, into the muscle, back into the muscles, which is what we want right now. With the milk, we have some protein, we have more carbs, and uh, we only have 1.5% fat. So perfect meal as far as I'm concerned. This is another great thing that I always like to eat after my weigh-in, which is honey melon because that's basically liquid carbs, like it's water with car with sugar, you know? So it's perfect, it's exactly what we, what you want right after the weigh-ins because you wanna have carbs, so you take up all the water again. Just like we didn't take any carbs for the last days, so we lo lose all the water in our body. So when you wanna ma manipulate water weight, you manipulate carbs. In terms of how much water do we drink now, the goal is to drink one liter of water every hour that we are awake till three hours before the fight. In the first hour, it's hard to stick to that and not drink more. I guess in the first hour, it's all right. And then after six or seven hours, it's gonna be hard to drink one liter again. So that's just a thing that you can try to aim, but I guess drink as much as you feel good, you know? It's four hours after weigh-in right now. I'm feeling a lot better. I ate almost the whole plate of the rice that I showed you, a little bit more of the melon, and I just had some water, uh, a good amount of water, and I'm feeling better again. My headaches is gone. So uh, I want to give you guys a little update on where I'm at right now in terms of weight. Okay, so right now I'm at 65.7, which is very good. I didn't eat so much yet, and I hadn't had so much water, so I'm up to schedule and I'm just gonna increase a lot more tonight and tomorrow, so. Okay guys, as you can see, I'm wearing, already wearing the fight gear um, and the shirt, but I'm gonna take this one off now because I wanna step on the scale and give you guys a little update. Okay, so I'm at 68.1, which is very good. 
uh, considering that this morning I was at 61.5. So I'm already feeling good again, starting to look good again as well. And yeah, yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm only gonna increase it. And right now it's seven hours after weigh it. So, so far I ate all of the rice uh, with the milk. I added a couple more blueberries and some honey. So that was very good. But actually I'm starting to be hungry again. So I'm about to eat a little bit more. I ate the melon, the whole thing. And I just stayed up to schedule with my water. So I've been drinking a good amount of water, one liter every hour, I think. Overall, I'm not taking it super strictly, but I, I've been, Rehydrate, rehydrating properly, so that's very good. Okay guys, it's the morning, so I'm gonna have some coffee. I brought my own coffee and my own French press because I wanted to have some good coffee here. And now what we're gonna have for breakfast is uh, porridge, the porridge that I prepared. I think we're gonna put some more milk just because uh, it needs some more milk. Then we have some skir, which is good for the proteins. And we're gonna put some sweet, uh, no, sour cherries. And that's gonna be a beautiful breakfast that I'm gonna enjoy. Okay, so why did I decide for this breakfast? Yesterday I told you we want carbs that are very, very fast. That's why we had the rice. Now the porridge will give me a little bit more energy throughout the day for the first couple of hours. So I'm not gonna have a dump afterwards. So that's why I'm choosing those today. And today it's not so important anymore to fill up the body with water. That's why we can have some carbs that take a little bit longer, but also give us a little bit more energy and uh, the skir for the proteins and the cherries because they taste nice so that's gonna be, that's the thought behind this meal okay guys to finish off the loading video where i show you how to reload and rehydrate and eat i'm having some brotherly shared rice crackers with max if he would max give me den, den cheers man um, and uh, let me step on the scale one more time so you guys know how much I weighed in the fight. Okay guys, to finish off the video properly, we're gonna step on the scale one more time after the fight. As you can see on my face. Um, but this time with socks. This is weird. 69 kilograms it says. So yeah. I guess I didn't even gain this much weight this time. This morning I was at 70, no, this, uh, this afternoon I was at 71, but now I guess not so heavy anymore. Okay, you, go, you step on there. <laughs> hmm. So he's way more fat now, even though he cut way less weight. That's hmm. not fair. Anyways, with that being said, that was the reloading video where I showed you guys how to reload properly after the weigh-ins, what to put in your drinks and also what to eat. With that being said, I hope you guys learned something and see you guys in the next video. See you soon and bis zum nächsten Mal.